सो गाइज बिफोर वी स्टार्ट विद द वीडियो जस्ट गोइंग टू द सेटिंग्स देन गोइंग टू बैकअप एंड रिसेट and backup everything and move this backup to your pc or uh, wherever or uh, any safe place so that if we lose anything then we can restore everything then to go into recovery mode power off the device now to boot into recovery mode press volume up plus power button then you will come into this this is the cwm recovery then just go to backup and restore and then backup the system one which is active right now then backup the system so it will take a cwm backup of that so let's wait till the backup is done so the backup has been done now go back and go to advanced and disable tdb that is true real boot disable this option so it will ask you uh, either to move data or wipe data so select wipe data and select yes disable true to your boot so when that's done go back do a wipe data factory reset and select yes wipe all user data so it will wipe all the user data then go and wipe cache then go to mount and storage and format system 1 then again format system 2 as we are installing both the systems which will be new so format both the system then go back and now install zip then select choose zip from sd card and select the cyanogen mod zip select this and select system 1 because cyanogen mod and all the aosp based rom will work only on system 1 so select system 1 and select install this so it will take some time to install let let's wait so that's done now again choose zip from sd card now we will install the gaps which are which has like uh, play store and all so uh, install that to in system 1 that will be installed quickly so after that go back and go to advanced and enable true dual boot option then enable this so it will ask you to move data or wipe data then again select wipe data and select yes enable true dual boot and then select reboot to recovery then select no for this so the device will reboot into recovery mode so as you can see over the device has rebooted into the recovery mode then again go to backup and restore and select restore then we'll restore this backup which is which was of miui 6 on the system 2 so that we will have system 1 which will be our cyanogen mod and system 2 which will have miui 6 so select this backup and then restore this to this the system 2 so that the miui 6 will come into system 2 and cyanogen mod will remain on system 1 so let's wait till the restore has been done so the restore has been done to the system 2 then just go back and select reboot system now uh, it will ask you to do, do this but select no and the system should reboot to cyanogen mod because we have installed that in system 1 so it will uh, and that's the default system so it will boot in the cyanogen mod so this is the cyanogen mod as you can see over here then just we'll just go back power of the device So now we'll boot into MIUI 6. To do that, go into recovery mode again. Now go to advanced once again, and you will have option over here that is active system option over here. Then select active system and select system two. 
okay so we have selected system 2 as our default system so let's reboot select no for that and the system should reboot to mi os 6 now so as you can see over here we have booted into system 2 uh, which is mi os 6 and as you can see over here mi os 6 is running smooth there are no force closes i'll just play a song Okay. so that's working everything is working right now so that's not an issue so there are no force closes over here so if you follow all the steps properly then you will be able to dual boot both the system like Cyanogen mod 11 and the MIUI 6 so this is it for this videos guys if you want to see another videos of Xiaomi Mi 3 then do check out in the description below uh, for MIUI 6 walkthrough, MIUI 6 features and tricks all I have made already a video so check that in the description below thank you guys thank you for watching make sure you subscribe to my channel and follow me on google plus thank you